Hello guys. So in this video, I will tell you some secrets about moving average cross strategy. And there are some truth pertaining to it as well. So bear with me, you will find this video very useful and it will save you a fortune if you will implement this advice. Now, usually uh, the most common moving average cross is uh, the 50 MA and the 200 MA. So when the green 50 MA crosses above the 200 MA, so it's also called uh, uh, bullish cross. So when this happens, it is generally assumed and it is generally perceived in the market that the price will continue to go up. The exact opposite of this thing is the death cross where the moving average 200 and the 50 a moving average it crosses the 50 moving averages crosses below the 200 moving averages so this cross is often called the death cross and when this happens the price is generally supposed to you know continue to fall down now this was a theory and this was a uh, academic thing which is generally taught in the courses and everywhere on the youtube but there is certain trick to it you need to ask yourself if moving averages crosses work then that's all we needed to do we will just wait for moving averages to cross up and then we would all become millionaires but what are we most of us are picking poor so this clearly shows that moving average uh, average crosses do not work and more often than not more often than not a moving average cross to 50 crossing the 200 will often result in the price reversal and similarly the 250 crossing below the 200 which is supposed to be death cross will often refer, re, result in the price reversal to the upside. So whenever, if you want to make money, you need to trade opposite to the herd. So whenever you will see these crosses, you need to immediately reduce your positions, except one condition, which I will tell you in few minutes. So first, let me show you the example of death cross, how they print the death cross and how it does exactly opposite of what it is supposed to do. That is, when the death cross happened, price was supposed to go down, but what happened? It actually went up. So this is the trade. This is Russell. And this is the April or May 2023. I saw this tweet. I saw the post of a, of a big uh, influencer on YouTube and Twitter who posted when I was having my exam that there was a death cross on Russell and now the price was plummet. Now the price would crash down. But what happened next? What happened next? I had to immediately go to my YouTube channel and I had to immediately I had to make this video three months ago. Trouble with being contrary and trade, trader. Initial discipline later, translating to cult like following. So I had to make this video where I showed you, where I, where I told you guys that big move up is coming, where everyone is shorting the bottom. So this, this video is on Russell. I made this three or four months ago. And you guys can see it. And this was the thing which was going on. That there was a death cross. And every influencer on YouTube was and Twitter was asking to short it. But what happened next? We went so high. And over here, we have a golden cross. 
the 50 going above the 200 right over here just check the just check the chutzpa just check the joke which is on us that right when there is a death, uh, golden cross price is supposed to go up and it plummets it drops down and when there is a death cross it goes up so this is this example these two examples are the clear examples of what you should be doing you should be trading against what is generally agreed upon wisdom in the market go and search all the moving average crosses youtube videos or wisdom on internet and you will find that whenever there is a golden cross you need to buy but what happened next the truth is something else there are often obviously there are some exception uh, to this my rule and that is that when the price is near 200 and the moving average 50 comes down from the below to a flattish 200 then it often often translates to the golden cross which goes up so this is the exception and you need experience to you know detect it you your eyes need to be experienced to see it otherwise you would not be able to get it so this is the exception i never trade golden crosses i never trade de death crosses in fact whenever i see crosses i try to do the opposite of what is in the market and i just showed you that they do not work So this, this was a death cross. Imagine shorting oil here to see it go to 150. So never, never trade crosses of the moving averages. They do not work. This was a golden cross. What happened? Down and then down. Price never went up. So trading, my friend, is not so simple. It's very difficult. And most of the people are in the market just to lose money. This is information. The link is in the comment section. You guys can join my group. And this is the number for the support. I, I do day trading of US indices, mostly NASDAQ. And I do quite good. So let me know in the comments, how did you find the moving average process video? It's totally opposite to what is there in, in the market. It's nothing special. I did not, I did not tell you anything special. It is, it was already, you know, the, the guys who are experienced, they know what it is. It is the moving average cross strategy is totally nonsense, but it is one of the most popular strategies in the market. So let me know in the comments. Do you guys trade moving average crosses, golden crosses, death crosses, or are you beyond it? And if you find my if you found my video useful, then give my video a like. Thank you very much. Bye bye.